Hello everyone, this is CypherDeck, and today we're back in Cyrus New Dawn. So we're going to be showing you some of the new things in the game. Uh, also, uh, some of the new mobs in the game. So let's go ahead and look at the skill tree first. So as you'll see here on the combat skill tree, we have two new weapons, which I've already made. Um, we have the charge rifle, and we also have the hydrogen torch. It's like a flamethrower kind of deal. And uh, also, to be able to use those, you need the ammo for them. You need the charge cell, and you also need the hydrogen canister. So it's going to take putting points into these two if you already haven't, then being able to get these. And then also for down here, uh, just getting to these two weapons to get these. So, I don't know about you guys, I'm still a big fan of this weapon. I've seen other people say they don't like the guns, but if you raid Queen Chloe very often, you should be able to get the diamond required for it, and I feel you just kill much faster using it. Uh, and the fact that I have the tree almost completely uh, done, I don't see why this would be a problem for me. Uh, to just have everything anyway. So, um, yeah, let's go ahead and get out of here. I should have uh, extra ammo. Let's see here. I have one extra ammo. Let's go ahead and put that in here. And this should have uh, almost a full clip, which it does. I went ahead and got the chemistry, or not the chemistry, I'm looking at the chemistry table. Also got the heavy rifle, uh, some ammo, and then also the um, the long rifle uh, ammo. So we're going to go kill Queen Chloe with each weapon and see if it is possible to kill her with that individual weapon. I know for a fact this can kill her. No problem. The heavy weapon, I've killed her many times. This is how I always take her out. This, I am almost definite that we can take her out with this. Just because it's a damage over time. And it might not do much damage, but it's supposed to do a lot more damage than um, than the other weapons, just because of the fact that it does tick uh, over time. So, we'll see. Um, so, other things that they've added to the game. The two new mobs, one is a flying cephalopod, I think is what it's called, and the other one is a ghost, which we'll definitely check out at night. The other things that they've changed are... Things that you used to harvest, or things that you still harvest because you need those resources, they now require you to, um, well, not require, they now only have a set amount of resource. So if you want to get rubber from the rubber tree, you can only hit those trees so many times. It's still, it's not liking where I landed, I guess. land this way there we go so let's go ahead and uh, kill some Queen Chloe okay so here we are back in the cave one thing I've noticed is that they make the dark areas much darker and I don't know if the ghost will spawn in here because there is a dead uh, individual in this area. But sh sh eh. knowing that there's ghosts now, that freaked me out. All right, let's go ahead and grab that. And... Jeez, man. All right. Let's head over here. Um, what? Okay. That's a new screen. Okay, we got some regular... Oh, hello. Ammo crate. Yeah, this isn't uh, the ammo that I use. This is what we need right here. Take all. It's making weird noises. Anyway, <laughs> let's go ahead. I'm going to use um, my machete. To get through these mobs just because it'll add some more combat um, points. Not that I need them. Um, just 
extras, I guess. <laughs> get those flags just to put outside our house when we get done with it. All right, come on, Snub. Show me what you got. Oh, you got stuck. You got stuck. Yeah, that's that's not good. Okay. You're dead. Okay, hey, buddy. I think I took a little bit of damage there. Thank you, sir. I don't need your net net foods. Nothing down here. I'm gonna have to change your battery soon. All right, everything seems normal uh, for this area. Not seeing items over here. Would think to have seen some something by now, some kind of ore. Okay, so that's uh, plutonium, I think, and that is carbon, or not carbon, copper, and that's plutonium, I think. All right, let's go ahead. So here is where we're gonna kill Queen Chloe from. I'm gonna just go on a basis of the heavy rifle because this is something that I've used a lot, and we'll. Just shoot her from here. Yep, I see you, buddy. That's clip three. Um, wow, the I think the gun is actually showing off a different um like it's really bright now for some reason all right there's that we only want diamond so give us some some of that i see you guys oh there's some diamond nice nope that's not diamond that's what aluminum aluminum okay lithium yeah plutonium and lithium okay we're done here all right guys i get it I get it. You don't like me being here. Great. You don't like me killing your, your oh. mother. Jeez. All right. I'm out. I'm out of If I can find it. All right. So that was pretty easy. It was like, what, three or four clips? Um... Though I think she might be a little stronger than she used to be because I thought she went down in two clips before. It's kind of hard seeing though with the gun flare. We'll see with the uh, the next one we're going to do is the sniper rifle. So if we compare the guns, the main difference is this is going to be a little bit harder hitting. I don't know why it's not actually showing the stats on it. Maybe because it doesn't have any ammo in it at the moment. But. There we go. So this right here is going to do 16 plus 4 with a 10% crit chance. This here is going to do a 12 plus or minus 3 um, with a 10% crit chance. This is only going to do a 1% crit chance with a 7 plus or minus 3. And then this guy is going to do up to 30 with a plus or minus 5 and 20% crit chance. So while this one can hit much harder, I don't know if that's going to be the one that actually kills her faster. Anyway, let's go ahead and throw this guy off of here. We're going to put some medical resources there. And let's get back into it. We need that diamond. And I'm gonna I'm gonna skip by him. I'm not gonna get any other resources from from him. And I guess we'll just shoot our way through here. I have well, I only have five clips, so I'm gonna I'm gonna definitely preserve them. Some lithium. Bring it on, snub. Oh, 
It's like, wait a minute. I didn't, I didn't know. I didn't know. All right. We're going to go straight for her. I, I don't think Diamond has ever spawned over here. Watch it actually spawns over here this time. <laughs> yeah, no Diamond. Yeah, this has a lot of resources now uh, all over, so maybe by putting these resources over here, we know that there's going to be diamond. Mm -hmm. All right, so now we're going to use this gun, and I'm going to try to point. It's very hard the way they have these crosshairs. Wow, that is only nine damage. Thirteen. <laughs> oh my goodness. This will take forever. Oh. Okay, there's one. This isn't going to take her down. It don't matter how many times we hit her. Do we need to hit her in the legs, maybe? She's turning around a lot. This is the worst gun ever. Okay, I can see him getting primed to jump at me. Oh, there we go. There's the meat and potatoes. Yeah, I don't think this is going to take her out. Ah, uh, you son of a gun. Alright. You're stuck, aren't you? Alright. Back to the fight. Actually, I'm going to turn the light off. It might actually be easier. But this thing is going to take forever to kill her. If it does. Yep, we're out. <laughs> it's much better. There she goes. Alright, I'm not even going to go to her. Uh, there's too many mobs in here because it took so long to kill her. And just see if we have any diamond. Nope, we have no diamond. Alright, we're out. So we know that that can take her out pretty easily. Um, there we are. So the last thing is the flamethrower, which is up close and personal. Uh, so hopefully it will be able to take her out pretty easy. We're going to have to heal up. All right, I will be back. All right, so we're going to need to do this one pretty fast. Um, let's see here. Let's get this right there. I'm almost out of liquid um, uh, hydration. So that's not good. Let's go ahead and just get through this one pretty quick. <clears throat> Light. Looking down here real quick. Plutonium. Are they even going to keep up with me? I don't know. <laughs> I'm not worried about it too much. We're going to go straight over to Chloe with our flamethrower. <clears throat> and uh, see what she's got. 
And here we go. And she's down. That fast. <laughs> That's amazing. Alright, let's get those. What is going on with her loot? Okay, here's some diamond. There's some diamond. Okay, let me get let me get a, a, a chisel uh, right there. Number four. Let's get it all. Yep, yep. I know it hurts. It hurts. Alright. Alright, so it only took us three rounds to get the diamond. Um, <laughs> stupid thing. Alright, let's get out of here. We got it. I need to go get a drink. It's because I've been running too much. Yep, yep. Go, go. Well, that was pretty easy. Um, I didn't even use a half a tank on on her so <laughs> that's that's very very powerful i am really liking that new gun i think it, i like it better than the charge gun just because of the fact that it is um it is a constant stream of fire and uh it has like 1200 units to it so it's has a pretty hefty um hefty gas tank though it can run through it pretty fast all right, so we're going back over to our home. We're going to kill some of those new mobs that are in the game. And I will show you about the uh, the new harvesting situation, which I think is good. But uh, others might have a problem with it. <laughs> um, I've been watching, actually, a few people's videos, and they haven't noticed it or mentioned it in their videos. So I don't know if people actually know that this is a thing yet. Uh, unless it was in the last patch and I just didn't notice it then. Alright. So I need to come over here. I don't know if it's here. Get two of those. Dying of dehydration is nice. Dying of dehydration is nice? Alright, buddy. Alright, so let's go ahead and see if we can't get one of these mobs over here. It would have been easier if we had a working crab guy. Because it could just walk right up on top of this thing here. Uh, let's see if I can uh, walk on there without falling. And I'm going to go ahead and change out this gun and that gun for this guy. Yep, it's going to be a problem. I don't know how that crab got up there. There we go. There we go. Alright. Now we just have to get up this. There we go. Come on. Yeah, they seem to perch up here. I think. Oh, now, <clears throat> now they're going to perch over on the other side. See how it is.
he perched? There he comes. Okay. So this is a young flying skelepod. And he has some new attacks from his uh, from his alien brother. One, as you can see, is acid. I haven't ever seen them swoop down on on people before, but they don't they don't drop anything new. They just drop meat, and then they have that purple blood. But yeah, there's one of the two mobs. Uh, let's go ahead and we gotta wait till nighttime for the other. The other one is, um, I haven't actually encountered it, but I know where to encounter it. So, let's hopefully, let's hope that we can get to it today. Um, I'm going to go ahead and move over there, and I'll wait till it's dark. And I need to go ahead and change out my battery. Let's go ahead and do that. So, battery. There we go. And then I need to go ahead and while we're waiting for nighttime. Oh, that was it. There he is. So he's this way. There he is. Oh, little guy. There he goes. Oh, hello. Deal with the wrath of the little guy. Okay, how are you doing on, um... Oh, hey. Let me see. Do I have a repair tool in my hand? I do not. Let's see, ability tree. Okay, nicely done. He is now maxed out. Oh! See, uh, repair. There he goes. Let me see something. His combat is 32. Oh, that's my combat. It's 32. Engineering is four plus, 400 plus. Science is 55. So he is he is able to do anything now. What is this? Gun speed overclock plus 25 combat. Um, shoots extremely fast now. All right. Go back to your job. Okay, there he goes. Let's go ahead and see what he's done for us since uh, since I put him out here. So he, he's given us a ton of resources. Uh, sort. Yeah, we're going to be fine on steel for a while. Um, even given give enough flowers. So nice, little Mr. Bebop. <laughs> All right. So I'm going to go ahead and head over uh, to, I think it is Osiris 1. Yo, I just met Osiris one, there we go. When I head there, uh, that is where the new mob is supposed to spawn. The other new one. And I, I don't know. This guy, I can't do anything with him. It's so disappointing. He is the best creature that we had. And now he is, I mean, he turns fine. He walks sideways fine. Maybe I just need to walk sideways. I don't know. But whenever you walk forward, Mr. Drunk Man. <laughs> oh my goodness, this is the worst. Let's see if we can if we can just live with it. Let's see if it, we, we can just fix it this way. I don't know. Can you go up that cliff? I don't know with your crazy little drunkenness walk thing that you're doing. 
Um, he's making it work. <laughs> he's making it work. Oh, yeah. There we go. Come on. You got this. You got it. Just don't don't push don't push sideways. Push forward. Okay, you're not gonna be able to do it. Oh, the good old days of being able to just climb anything with this guy. I don't know why he's doing this. I'll, I, it's got to be something that they changed whenever they added the new mobs, maybe. I don't know, but I I fought these these crab guys and they don't act like that anymore, or they don't act like that at all. There it is. This thing takes forever to land. There we go. So the new mob here is that ghost. And what they do is... Um, they start out fine. Wait a minute, look at that crab. He seems to be walking fine. He's not walking drunk. But uh, they start out where they're just standing there. And then they get supposedly horrifying. And I think the only weapon that you can use for them is the charge rifle. So let's go ahead and get that guy up. And, um, let's go ahead and make it nighttime. Alright, it's getting dark now. So, we should start to hear them. And then we should start to see them. The new mob. Come on, guys. Show your face. Whoa, whoa. There he is. Oh, jeez. Oh, my. Oh, hello. Ouch. They like to move right behind you. Uh. Uh. Okay, got him with a critical. Oh, I don't like that. I don't like that at all. They don't like it either whenever you hit them. Eh? Eh? No? Is he turning red? Did he... Oh, jeez. I missed. I missed. I missed! Uh, whoa, whoa, whoa. I can't tell if it's... Okay, he's dead. He's gone. He's gone. Jeez, man. Did he not drop anything? But you can go back, apparently, and the other ghost should appear. Hey, I'm not hearing them. Oh, I hear them now. <laughs> they really don't like that. Oh, jeez. Oh, 
we're halfway through our canister here. Okay, one more maybe? Two more? I like how they just get mad and stay in there. Hello. Eh? What the? What the? What was that? And he's gone. Oh, what? What the heck? Oh, okay. Okay, you you are... I, I can take you out. That's no problem. Yep, yep, yep. Okay, he's, he's taken care of. Let's get out of here. <laughs> I am done with ghosts. That, that was crazy. All right. So I think we're going to go ahead and end here. That was pretty much everything that they've added in the update. Uh, the new mobs, the new guns, and then also the fact that they have changed it so that you can only harvest so many of... Um, oh, there was one more thing I do want to show you. Okay, let's see if we can see it. Uh, we're looking for the blue planet. There she is. Yes, please. All right, so here we are. Um, we're going to go onto the planet. I'm going to land so that we can uh, look for our inflatable. Okay, I'm upside down now. Okay, there we go. We actually have a good landing area right here, probably. Let's go back around. Bring that speed down. Oh, not bullseye. Bullseye. <laughs> it's a nice and clear day today. So, um, looking for inflatable dome. There it is. I'm going to try to stay low, I feel. And we'll just follow this. And we may actually see it before, before then. Actually, I think that's tungsten. I need some of that. Let's come back around. Actually, it looks more like obsidian, but we'll check it anyway. Oh, I'm on fire. Oh. Oh, no. Oh, no. Yeah, that's why. That's definitely obsidian if it's going to... It's just uh can't see the fire because we're, it's not nighttime. Okay. There they are. They added the mobs back to the planet. Now these mobs were here before. Um, they've just finally added them back. And we'll just go over what everything is real quick. Let me get... I think my, my actual building is over here. Got my little fly vehicle vehicle here. 
All right, so these are cow giraffes. Um, then you have the snubs over here. They're ice snubs, ice crabs, monster. Um, I don't know if there's anything else to notate. Uh, I know that there's a thing called a salamander. It's like the biggest mob I've seen on this planet. We'll go ahead and just look around a little bit. See if we can't find anything else. But they did go ahead and add all the mobs back. Was kind of happy about that because we weren't seeing it last time we came here. It was kind of um, a dud to come here uh, and not have any of the mobs. Okay, let's see. Trying to see where one would be. I think they actually st stay on the cliffs here. But I may be completely wrong. Oh, hello. Don't tip. Don't tip over. Not seeing them. Maybe over here. I don't know. Anyway, there's uh, there's one other uh, mob that I know of that's a salamander. It's six legs, and it is very big. But I don't think it can actually attack you, and you can attack it. Um, I think that's just something that they still have to work on. Again, this game is early access, so you're not going to get everything working right away whenever they add a patch. There, of course, there's going to be things that don't work right away. Say, Ice Crab Monster. Let's go ahead and come back up here. There we go. And uh, we're back. So, yeah, the they did go ahead and populate the planet again. And uh, hopefully they'll add new mobs here. Uh, just because there's people who do live up here instead and not having any kind of food source is kind of weird. Though I don't think you can harvest anything off of these drafts. Uh, it looks like I need to repair this vehicle. So <laughs> let's go ahead and put him back over in his, uh, in his bay. And get the repair gun out if I have it. Vitals dropping. Vital stabilized. Fuel up oh, no. Um there we go. Okay, he's back good to go. Is it Oh, do I have to repair three parts of it? Yes, I do. Oh, look at that. It's actually get, moving back into shape whenever you do that. What do we do? Thing took a lot of damage. Okay, there you go. And this side is. Okay, that's good to go. This side's good to go. Thing back here. Yep, we're good. We have 22% fuel. Anything in here that I need to take with me? Nope. All right, I think we're going to go ahead and end it there. Hopefully you enjoyed. This is Cypher Deck. Peace out.